God, I'm almost. Uh, I could, how y'all doing? Facebook, YouTube. I'm bugging y'all. You know, I'm bugging y'all with the truth. Yeah. I think I got something quite, you know, fascinating. It might be quite fascinating for you. But, you know, hey, maybe, maybe not. You might be so bright. Hopefully that you're bright, but not bright from your own view and perspective, which that kind of be the ideal of this message I'm giving you. Type of uh, Topic of this message of, uh, you know, here's the thing. It's called... The reality of one requirement. I don't know if I can. I'm going to try to title that. that One requirement. Now, I'm going to give you an examination. You're going to get examined. I'm going to examine some of y'all if y'all want examination. Now, check this out. Um, okay, you. I'm going to ask you a question. And it's, you know, got only two Multiple choice A and B, you know, how that only got two. So you only got two answers, you know, to answer. No both answers. No. No, Mac don't got all the above. Got two. Now, um, oh, I'm gonna have I'm gonna do multiple choice, you know, soon after I'm done with these uh questions. These are just A and B. Number no number one, question number one. Here's a question. Are you who are you? Or you are a type of being that came out of his her her came out of his came out of her mother's womb, or are you a type of being that created planets? A mother's womb, B planets. Did you came from did you came from a place that you can create your own planet? Alright. Now, um now uh now are you the next question is uh did you um you know you have one we, we have one planet we have one planet yeah we have one planet that's it we have one planet uh do this planet has many purposes or one purpose <laughs> uh me a many one B. Yeah. yeah. Now, I'm finna give you a multiple. Now we're done with that test. You're done with that test. We're done with that, you know, A and B. Now I'm finna give you an interesting idea of what I'm trying to get to about this one requirement. Now, uh, I'm finna uh give you some vehicles. We got A truck. B car, C uh, motorcycle, and D SUV. And now I'm fin to give you ask you a question. Um, question one: uh, Which vehicle can I use for a motorcycle race? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. All right. Which uh, vehicle I can use if I want to carry, you know, tote large amount of things, you know, heavy, large amount of things, you know, which vehicle I use and which vehicle I need, what can use if I just want to go to and fro and to and fro, you know. Um, here, there, there to go. But which vehicle I can use that I can get like a little bit more room, you know, have more room inside of, you know, my vehicle, you know, that more people and I can put other stuff in there. Of course, you know, you know, you you put your answers down to those, you know, questions. Now, understand those questions. You like. You know, let's talk about the motorcycle race. You know, you here's the question: If I asked you that question, which vehicle would you use for a motorcycle race? How long would it take for you to answer that question? When I gave you a motorcycle, I think C. 
You know what I'm saying? I don't know. We, I forgot a letter I put on it. But I put out motorcycle. How long you will be like, hmm, which one, which one, which one, which one, which one, which one? And it's supposed to be an easy no-brainer. But you're thinking which one, which one, which one. Now, reason why you might be thinking which one, which one, which one, because, you know, I'm not really trying to play a trick on you uh, concerning, you know, question you pick, but I'm trying to see if you really want to, well, maybe I should try this SUV. And maybe I should, you know, put this truck in there, you know? Or maybe I should try the, the car, you know? You know, you like, maybe, maybe, I don't know, it might be. Mm. Yes, you know, you, you, you think, well, oh, Mac, you know, I will never do something like that, you know, Mac? In, in, you know, in life, when there's one requirement to, you know, uh, make a choice, I will just be, you know, straight up, bam, boom. Uh, motorcycle. <laughs> well... Not, you probably won't be, you know, concerning the way this world system, you know, if you operating in darkness, in this spiritual world system, watch this. You know, we got this, you know, problem that people got this thing called, you know, gay marriage, you know. <laughs> yeah, and they got this thing called uh, homosexuality and they say, you know, hey, you know. Man should be with man, woman should be with woman. Simple. That should be easy to figure out because they fit together some kind of way. Mm. But I, you know, will just ask a question, you know, just asking a question, how you doing? Um, and says, well, you know, if I create, if a creator created a jigsaw puzzle, no, not use a jigsaw puzzle. Well, you know, I, you know, the baby things, you know, the square, you know, rectangle and a circle thing that the baby, you tell a baby to put, fit this in and fit this in. Will, you know, when you take that square and that rectangle, uh, can I put this, this square in a circle and it fits right in? Can, if I put this, uh, a rectangle in the square would it fit right in? If I put the circle in the rectangle, I mean, well, the triangle area would it fit in? Yeah. And leave it there. Hello, how you doing? Um, what will be your answer? <laughs> oh, what will be your answer? That's what I will say. What will be your answer if I can fit something? Can I fit anything in the way I can fit anything at? You know? I'm not going to give you no answer. How you doing? Because I understand in life that guess what? Reality is supposed to give you an answer. That's what it's supposed to be. You know, yeah. that it's supposed to be concerning one requirement. <laughs> one requirement is supposed to produce... A situation here you know like I see these situations are not producing something but it's asking for production from the outside you know what I'm saying you know they got these adoptions yeah it's asking for something from the outside a outside force as a step trying to establish something when a relationship is about you know two people I mean well these kind of relationships is about a form of intimacy that somebody is getting into me and producing something that has two chromosomes of uh, chromosomes of two people yeah yeah two chromosomes are co connecting you know and forming a child yes but in this relationship there's no chromosomes forming hmm. nothing producing between the two but, you know, but here's the thing. What is the requirement? What, what it requires to have two chromosomes coming together? You know what I'm saying? It should be the answer. 
but because popular opinion oh I am wrong <laughs> but in realities facts <laughs> yeah facts because this is facts that you need two people to create two chromosomes to, that's um, science and you know health class um, to establish or truly establish something together yeah and it forms a child that will you know supposed to be a potential person to raise a family themselves yeah and you think that you know that would be an easy interpretation to see things like that no not how dark satan got this world is and this world is full with a lot of darkness you know what i'm saying and it's just sad you know like you know everybody's saying you know oh you know, try the truck. Try to make this truck a uh, uh, motorcycle so it can enter the motorcycle race. <laughs> or try to make this, you know, uh, car into a, a motorcycle car. Or the, to enter the motorcycle race. Everybody's trying to get to this one, one race and trying to, you know, make and shape and manipulate this one race to enter into... To something just only in requiring a motorcycle. Yeah, that's what's going on. And anything that's a form of manipulation is not really making anything that is reality, that is real. And that's the thing about the one requirement that you have to understand concerning the reality of the truth that you know what's going on but here's the thing there's light and there's darkness and unfortunately a dark system is what's going on in the world mainly that is influencing a lot of people that they just cannot have the discernment to see what's right and what's wrong correctly because of all the darkness and all the dark desires that, you know, Satan, the God of this world, is putting in the minds of people, blinding them, it says in Second Corinthians 4 and 4, with television and radio and, you know, what's going on in the environment, all the negativity that is producing so much is clouding and, 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 and messing up people's judgments of what they're trying to make and create their own reality based upon dark feelings and hurt and pain and disappointment that or lack of you know having the better influences around you to position people in a bad place of life that is too many people out there in that position that you know is really the problem of the situation but guess what Yes, that's going on, but, you know, it's time for the light to start shining bright and bright to, for people to see the reality of the truth. And everybody can know the truth and that the truth will set them free, that they can see the true reality, that they will live in it and establish something that, you know, is real and not false. All right, that's the message. I hope you understand the one requirement. Hope you understand. You may not agree with it, but I hope you come to search and understand this reality and understand it because it's the best way to live a better life, you know, and a life in the reality to God. Be the glory here forever and ever. In Jesus' name, amen.